So this Thursday, as if you didn't know, the Nuggets will be playing the Heat at Ball Arena. Just about 15 minutes ago, Miami beat Boston in Game 7 of the Eastern Conference Finals. It was a tight series. Many didn't think the Heat could pull it off. Miami won the first three games, and then Boston won the next three, had all the momentum. And tonight, the Heat just came out strong. They held the lead over the Celtics for most of the game, winning 103 to 84. The Heat winning means that Denver will have home court advantage for the finals. Rod's going to have much more later on the show to talk about the game. As you can imagine, the energy among sports fans pretty wild right now. The bars were packed tonight, people out watching. Our crews were out at a few watch parties too, chatting with some of the fans. He had some supporting the Heat, some supporting the Celtics, and some, you know, really just don't care either way. They're just waiting to see who the Nuggets are playing on Thursday. Nuggets, nug nuggets are taking it. Ain't nothing stopping Jokic at all. The Joker ain't, ain't come to play. He's not playing games, and he ain't no clown. I bought season tickets at the beginning of uh, this season. And I always said that if it did happen, and here we are, I'm going to wear the, the Heat jersey. Oh, C's a winner for sure. Sorry, Denver fans, but, you know, you're my second. Mm, I don't know. With the way these both of the teams have played, they look like a different team in every game. And, you know, Nuggets I know. have been solid all the way through. Uh, yeah, and kind of both of them to some degree, not the choice of the national media. So, mm -hmm. But those Celtics fans, I mean, they're, they're, they're intense. <laughs> They're pushy, <laughs> yeah, just but a tad. right now they're not so happy. Anyway, we're all focused on the Nuggets. So yep. Thursday it's on.